pleasure of introducing to you all Devin Hitu. Uh, Devin is a student at the University of Rhode Island. Good morning. My name is Devin Hitu, and I'm a rising freshman at the University of Rhode Island. I'm also a member of the Rhode Island Coalition Against Gun Violence, Student Demand Action, and the March for Our Lives. Every single day in the United States, 100 Americans are killed due to gun violence. Every single day in the United States, 59 people end their lives with a firearm. Every single day, thousands fear for their lives, not knowing if they'll be the next statistics. Every single day, we push for change to ensure events like this never happen again. If you combine the number of people killed by homicides and suicide, approximately 58,035 people will die by the hand of a gun each year. For perspective, this is about 1,044,630 people in my short 18 years on this planet. This is just the number of gun-related deaths in the United States alone. A further 51 people suffered non-fatal injuries and a further 31 people lost their lives in a 14-hour period in two different cities. Those that witness will carry lifelong emotional scars. Those two states, Texas and Ohio, had one thing in common. Neither had red flag gun laws. And 43 other states also allow for someone to carry a loaded semi-automatic weapon in a public setting. One can carry without background checks safety train and safety training. In contrast, states that have adopted red flag laws have seen a dramatic decrease in the amount of firearm-related suicides and homicides. According to Everytown Research, the amount of suicide deaths by firearm has fallen 14% since Connecticut instilled these laws. For every 11 firearms confiscated, one life has been saved. Red flag laws are essential in all states to protect all people. Concerned family and friends may report their loved ones if they, if they express wanting to hurt themselves or others, and this can leave a countless amount of lives. Nobody should live in fear. Nobody should live thinking that the visit to their store could be their last. No parent should lose a child and no, parent should, no child should be both parents in a shooting. No family should have to identify a deceased relative. National red flag gun laws have been put on hold, but they are fully necessary on the federal level. We need to show our lawmakers that we care. We need to support common sense gun laws to save lives. We need this to be a national policy. To let them know, please take out your phones and text CHECKS in all caps to 644-33 to encourage them to take action. Thank you.